My dad died, I found out today. And apparently he died on my birthday. There are lots of videos on YouTube about dealing with death, and I'm sure they're all good, but I'm wondering how I'm going to deal with it. I mean, my dad wasn't really around, and he missed kind of my teen years and young adult years, which are right now. So, when I first heard the news, I was sad and stuff, you know, on the inside. And it wasn't like I was pretending to not be sad. But, since he wasn't there, er, uh, I didn't live with him, of course, I guess it didn't have an immediate impact, because I have a friend who lost her best friend, one of her best friends in a car accident, which she was in. They were being chased by the police and they crashed and stuff. And her friend died, and she was in the hospital for a few months. And, uh, she was... It took her, my, my friend, a few months to really realize that her friend was dead. So, that might be the same scenario with me, like it will take me a while to really, for my dad's death to really sink in because he wasn't such an active person in my life. So at the funeral, I will say an honest speech about this. You know, you can guess my mom doesn't particularly care for him. Uh, and I see why. So, I'm not going to fantasize about my father like a lot of men do. Not, not just African Americans, but other races too. Like, with their father was never dead, and they kind of fantasize about their father. Like, what he could be doing in all this mess. But I understand that if he was really such a great father, and like, he would buckle down and try to help me. Or help his other kids, whatever. But, um, so I'm not going to fantasize about my father just because of this. He wasn't there, he wasn't there. I know he's been taking care of me and looking after me on mom, and I'm helping her around the house, too. I just want, but I really am just sad because I'll never get to reconcile with him or see what happened or see what he's done with his life or what's happened since I last saw him, which was quite a while ago. That's really what it's about, that I never get to talk to him again, or like meet him, or hunt him down someday when I can. I'm going to the funeral tomorrow, taking the airplane to the place where they're going to bury him. I'm going to see his picture, I'm going to see his coffin casket, I might even take some pictures of the funeral and stuff, so I'll show you. I mean, well, maybe. Might be a little personal. But to everyone out there, uh, this is somewhat of a difficult time in my life. But I guess the reason why I'm not too sad and emotional and it's not my entire world is being destroyed is because he wasn't really active in my life. So, he is deceased now. He was sick. He had a heart attack. Kind of like Tim Russert guy. But, uh... I guess it really just needs to sink in or I need to think about those things. I mean, sorry if I was mumbling, but I'm still looking at these YouTube videos on how to deal with death, and I'm not sure, and I guess there really ultimately is no one right or wrong way. I just have to take this my own way. I'll see what I'll do. But comment or message me if you have any things. And by the way, about my father's death, he died on my birthday. I might have already said that. But I found out two days, or one day, after my birthday. I guess it was for the best, you know. So it wouldn't ruin the birthday party, since if he was dead, he's dead. Uh, and I had a friend with me when I got the news from one of my uncles.